Howdy, howdy, everybody. Cookie Dial here. How's everyone doing? Um, we are diving into Jurassic World Evolution 2. Um, I honestly have no idea what number this is. But I looked it up, and literally the last thing to do on here is get that 5-star rating. So I'm not going to bore you guys with that. I will do that on my own time. For the sake of that, I can't believe that last four percent is just get five star rating. But whatever. Um, also, we have more stuff down here now. Now there's this, this. Well, these two might have already existed, but there's this now. Uh, which is cool. I did go watch this finally, and there's more near this. So this is what we're going to be diving into. Challenge mode, race against the clock to build a five-star park. I need to get better at building parks first. DFW campaign. Dominion campaign. Biosyn. Well, I'm glad this actually had no spoilers in it, as it turns out. So, thank goodness for that. Also, if you haven't watched the movie yet, before I start the, before diving more into this, please go. Oh my god, like my whole apartment is echoing. I hope that's not echoing here on the mic. I just need more stuff in my apartment. Hold on. Is it echoing? Yeah, it is echoing a little bit, at least in my apartment. But, anywho. I have some time to record, so we're going to dive into this. Existing auto save data will be overwritten. Continue. Okay. As John Hammond realized his vision for Jurassic Park, his competitors began to see the potential of InGen's work. One of their main rivals, Biosyn, looked to close the gap by stealing the advantages that InGen and Dr. Wu had worked so hard to gain. To do this, they would need someone on the inside. So they enlisted a disgruntled computer engineer named Dennis Nedry. A plan was devised to steal InGen's dinosaur embryos with an inconspicuous canister created to house the precious commodity. Nobody really knows what happened that fateful night. What is certain is that Dennis Nedry and the samples were never seen again. Biosyn had failed. Unfortunately, so too had Hammond's dream. Decades later, businessman Simon Mizrani tried again, this time succeeding in delivering Hammond's vision to the world. Tragically, things didn't go as planned. Biosyn was waiting for its time, and they found it in the aftermath of Jurassic World's downfall. Now, led by Lewis Dodgson, a new era was dawning. While we don't know what the future holds, history has a habit of repeating itself. All the builds are on the same island, even. Jeez. Dogs, Dodge, Dodgson, just Dodgson, is planning to turn Biosyn genetics into. Fine then. Just look at it. It's beautiful. We are so close to realizing Biosyn's dream, one that InGen could never achieve. Once we get dinosaurs here, it will be perfect. A perfect display of evolution. Luck favors the bold. We were prepared. Now we need to finish the job. Give me the latest on the animals. We're isolated, which makes for a challenging landscape. We are still at a disadvantage until we understand more about this ecosystem and how our new friends will adapt to it. We need more information and time. The last thing we want is for them to not adapt and die. Oh, they'll adapt. I believe that. 
They adapted to two parks and a few islands. They're adapting now. They'll be just fine. Just get them here. I'm not sure we are totally ready to understand everything we need to. Just get them here. Leave the rest up to Mother Nature and me. I guess what they say is true. It's location, location, location. More than you realize, this is perfect. Keeps us away from the public's prying eyes and keeps the political do-gooders at arm's length. I think what InGen had and fumbled away. They never saw the bigger picture. All dinosaur and zero business. That is where Biosyn wins. We bring a balance that InGen never understood. We see the whole picture. Okay. What's our next step? I don't want to waste any time getting this going. Well, it all starts with the control center. Remember, it needs to be connected to the Hyperloop network. All right, then. Get started. Oh, boy. The Hyperloop is an underground network that can be used to connect certain buildings together instead of paths. Okay, so I don't need paths, I just need hyperloop. The control center acts as the junction between the hyperloop and the path network. It must be connected to the research compound via hyperloop at all times. Okay. Oh my god, my back is itching. Okay. The hyperloop can conduct power to con to connected buildings if the hydro power hub is part of the network. The hyperloop can conduct power to connected buildings if the hydro power hub is part of the network. Okay, as long as we keep the hydro hub part of this, power is not an issue. Construct a control center. That is off limits, apparently. <laughs> oh, I see. That part has to. Connect the hyperloop from control center to research compound. Where's my research compound? Research compound. Everything's in place for us to get our new research compound constructed. Great then we can focus on getting it operational. Let's just cram it in the back. Over here, shall we? Isaac, update? Everything is going to plan. We should have the research we need shortly. Great. Carry on. Advanced construction of the research compound. Research the following stage one core facilities. Facility details. Assess. Asset rating low. Yeah, that's fine. for that stuff. Low. 
The research stuff is different now. Okay. I have a generalist. 433. Okay. Let's get it underway. What does it do? Facilities so and person and personnel to run scientific and staffing operations allows construction of many BIOS and genetics operations buildings. Cool. Why do you say you don't have a path? You have a path. You have the Hyperloop, which is completely invisible unless I'm building. Please listen to mission debriefing. Okay. Okay, that did it. We have access to the core facilities research. Great. Our vision is coming together of each building we get operational. Ramsey. We just need to ensure we can handle all the dinosaurs when they arrive. I think we can do that. It's all starting to come together, just as we envisioned. We are leaving InGen in our dust. Well, I will give them some credit. They did resurrect the dinosaurs from extinction. Uh, sure, through a rushed agenda and lazy science. We're doing it right. Their failures were our education. We won't be making the same mistakes Hammond and his team made. InGen always fell in love with their own wonder. They wanted to prove to the world that they could do it. Once they did, they wanted to showcase them as circus freaks and rub our faces in it. They didn't get it. Evolution is not just DNA and frogs, it also happens in business to advance the world. Think of what we will bring to the world. Think of what we will bring to humanity. New medicines, biotechnology, beauty products, you name it, we will own it. Construct operate. A functioning facility. operation. That is the only way we can secure the dinosaur survival. Absolutely, we'll get it done. See that you do. A lot is riding on it. Paleo medical facility emergency shelter. Oh. Put it here. Paleo one goes there. These don't get hyperloops? Well, that's lame. Peter Station receives and then provides power to two structures in radius without pylons. Must be linked to power source for instant power. Oh my god, I can fit it back there. Is it not going to have any power source? <sighs> Come on. You are totally connected to it. <sighs> Whatever.
and squeeze you back there. Do I have to hyperloop that? There we go. Emergency shelter. That's a little crammed, but I'm trying to keep the operational buildings more condensed and not so crazy like I had in the uh, one in the Chaos Theory. I don't know how much of this is buildable territory, but we'll find out. We've been authorized to expand our team, specifically scientists. Look over the candidates, and let's add some to our operation. <sighs> Additional scientists increase total skill, too. Okay. Um, do I do it here? I can edit the hyperloop from this, too. Okay. Weapons for wide fossil center extraction capacity fossil staff center. Okay, so I have to do the. Oh, I can't because I don't have a scientist to do it. Is this my science? Oh, it is my scientist. Here we go. Okay. Welfare specialist increase welfare potential by five and welfare skill by three. I like you. You get to come on board. You're expensive, but you'll be worth it. Cheaper expedition. Faster expeditions. I'll take it. Okay, let's crew one more. That almost feels racist a little bit. <laughs> um, you have zero on logistics. No. You have zero on genetics. I don't like people with zeros. But you do have a nine in genetics. A possible nine in genetics. Sheesh. Increase unrest limit by four. Motivated. Oh, I should grab one of these people who can get really high stuff. <sighs> okay. So I think I need someone with good genetics. You're expensive, but you know what? Hey, I have exciting news. We're closing in on some exclusive biosyn tech. Invisible fencing. It'll secure the animals while removing the traditional man-made constructs that have surrounded their environments. So, no visible barrier between us and the dinosaurs? That sounds terrifying. Uh, 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 the more these animals believe they are not in cages, the healthier they will be. Yeah, that will make them easier to care for. I think 
we'd better place some research outposts as well. We can observe our animals safely from there. You know, it's bad enough that dinosaurs never knew what a fence was until we placed them around them. But what if they become dependent on them to feel safe? At least they could see a barrier between us and them. How are they even going to trust their environment with invisible fences? How are they even going to know where they are? Oh, believe me, they'll feel it if they try to cross one. Yeah, that. I don't know. Look, it feels like we're messing with them and how comfortable they'll be in their environment. You're concerned about fences? The dinosaurs never saw a human before either, and that hasn't stopped us. I like Ramsey. Research complete. Books unlocked. Okay. <sighs> Ready to research. Go to research. Um, research the following. Okay. Stage two. Welfare facilities and personnel to secure, monitor, and treat living dinosaurs allows construction and development of dinosaur enclosures. Goodness gracious. Four and four. Oh, you are so close to just being the one that does it all. Okay. You. You. Alright, so now we just wait for that. Speed that nonsense up a lot. I'm losing money while I wait for it. I don't think it's hardly fair. Research the following. Isaac, we've got an issue. We're in need of more power. How close are we to maximum output? Already there. We won't be able to hold much longer. Then we'll need to research how to get more. Upgraded power stations is the way forward. Let's get to it. Perfect. Unlock stage one to access. Gain access to a persistent generation of power and the network to spread it around the park. Easy peasy. Why do I need six there? I can only use two. Okay. Well, when you're getting cheaper research here, then. Blame. But whatever. Apply the increased output upgrade to Hydro Power Hub. Okay. Glasses need to go over there. Okay, go here, go here, here. Before we go any further, there's something I want from you. Through my connections, I've arranged for a number of dinosaurs to be delivered here to our facility. They're coming all the way from Isla Sorna, so you'll have some time to prepare for their arrival. I'm confident you won't let me down. They're going to need enclosures, secure enclosures. Safety is essential for them and us. And we have to get this right. We don't need another InGen or Masrani incident. Absolutely. We will do better. Isaac, I remember you being part of the other game. Okay. Separates dinosaurs from operatives and each other. Oh, that's a gate. I see. I see. Okay. So the first dinosaurs are coming. Time to scout the entirety of this map. Uh, 
Okay. Cool beans. Five of them. Asset being transported. Asset in transit. Oh, we got Gala Minus coming. We need another one. Where are they at? <sighs> Dude, it's hard to see these gates. fruit. Transit has commenced. 
How many of these suckers is there? Holy cow, okay. Forest. Now you want forest. Okay. Asset transported. Confirming asset delivery. Water. That's okay. Let's deal with these now. I'm dumb. Asset has been transported. Okay. Asset transportation complete. Whoops, I can just do it this way. As I've learned. Way faster. Delivery has been completed. Okay. One dino done. You're just lonely. Leave you alone for now. Ground leaf. Okay. What gives me ground leaf? That does. Now you want some forest. Okay. Where's your gate? Asset has been collected. It looks like the enclosures are ready. We need to make these habitats as desirable for the dinosaurs as we can. I'm trying to, man, but you're in the way. Ground nuts. What gives me ground nuts? None of those. Ground fruits, tall fruits, ground nuts. What else do you want? Ramsey, I've been going through the data, and I think we can make some real progress if we get a research outpost connected to our Hyperloop. Yeah, makes sense to me. Awesome. Now let's make it happen. Without proper security, we slip into the same chaos that brought down our rivals. Yes. But our ranger team should be capable of maintaining order. We'll set up the necessary patrols. Yeah. 
I don't have to remind you, remote monitoring can only go so far. Of course. We'll get right on it. Raising viewing platform used to provide dinosaur visibility. Specially designed for BIOS and Sanctuary, it can only be accessed by Hyperloop. Dinosaurs only appeal to guests if they have been recently viewed. Visible. <sighs> okay. This is why I left those gaps. I also just stuffed that in an enclosure. God, I feel stupid. I put that right smack dab in the middle of my enclosure. How long have I been recording? Okay. Oh, uh, whatever. It's stegosauruses. It's not going to hurt them. I hope. Okay. So we have that increased dinosaur visibility. Okay, fine. Facilities. Where's the actual gate? heard the phrase you are victims of your own success because gentlemen that's where you find yourselves both of you I'm not sure I follow it means we're doing our job so we can take on even more whatever the challenge we're ready then welcome to the biosyn genetics research compound phase three this will allow us to continue expanding our genetic engineering division and take our operations to the next level biosyn is counting on you more importantly, I am counting on you. We need perfect genetic samples for the best outcome. That is something Piosin will write a check for. Yeah, but we're not yet in control. We're dependent on others until we get in a position to send out our own expeditions. And I don't like being unable to control the outcome of something. Yes, but once this research is done, we'll be able to send out our own expeditions. We should be in a better place around our samples. If we own and control it, it's better for Biosyn. And you. Okay. Research stage three. Got it. What do I need? Let's do that. Make 
little cheaper, you know? The whole reason I hired that guy. Yeah, it's going fast enough. So some things can be hooked up to the Hyperloop and some can't. Okay. So these invisible gates can't. Construct an operational expedition okay. center. Construct an operational fossil center. center. Don't forget, we'll need a fossil center too. Understood. These buildings will put biosyn at the cutting edge of bioengineering. Operations. There's a staff center. I need that. Oh, facility. Oh, here we go. Fossil Center, Expedition Center. Put you there. What did I just build? Expedition. Okay. Fossil. Build a staff center. I have not. Let's fix that. I like how compact this one lets you be. My understanding is that we're ready to send out a team? That's correct. Good. I want you to start with an amber mining expedition. This valley wasn't chosen by accident. This area is rich with amber. And I intend for Biosyn to exploit that. Insects trapped in prehistoric tree sap. That is what we need. This is where our dinosaurs begin. This amber? is going to be the time capsule that links us back to the era of the dinosaurs. It's a window to the past, and worth billions. Ramsey, have our scientists extract what they can from the fossils. That'll increase our genome diversity. Yes, on it. And what is the end goal of this? To do the impossible, again. The amber mine contains rich deposits of amber fossils, which can be extracted to acquire a genome for new existing species. The amber mine is split into multiple levels, which can be unlocked through research. Oh, okay. And scientists on expeditions to retrieve new amber fossils from deposits. Ascend scientists. Okay. Okay, they're keeping. The necessary buildings. Increase genome. The Matrigon. them off to do that. How's the dinos doing? Content, content, content. Just 
Stegosaurus. That's probably misspelled, but whatever. No, it's not. Gally minus. Gally minus. Parasaurolophus. Where did I put your station? Oh. Parasauro. Pronounce that, I just misspelt it. Spot on, all right. A few fossils. I see, the more complete it is, the better more genome you get from it. I see. Why do I need three on the beaker? Generalist. I keep seeing like movement across my window. Okay, um, yeah, no, the beginning of these are not very exciting, and I apologize. That's taking too long. We speed that up. God, it even takes a while with it on times three. Was that income, or was that loss? Oh, that's income. Yes, we making money now. Good. Finally. I'm trying to be more strategic about where I place Construct an operational hatchery, That's synthesize, it. incubate, and release We've the following We've a breakthrough. Dinosaur. An entirely new genome. So what you're saying is we've discovered a new dinosaur? One we've never seen before? Sort of. It is incredible, but it's not actually a dinosaur, per se. It's a prehistoric synapsin called Dimetrodon. Huh. Did Hammond have one of these? I don't believe so. Perfect. A biosyn exclusive. This DNA is only part of the puzzle, though. We still need to build a hatchery and then synthesize this new breed. Once we've done that, we can incubate and release them. I can't wait. I don't need it to be attached to any. To be honest. Just cause. Since I released the following dinosaur, Dimetrodon. Okay. Synchronize. Okay, we have access to all of these already. 
<sighs> okay. Like how we have Stegosaurus, but we don't have access to the genomes for Stegosaurus. Kind of funny, you know? Pyroraptor, I was right. That was a Pyroraptor in the movie. Okay. Alright, well anyways, we need this thing. I'm not going to modify its genome right now. I need four beaker. I'll lead you to that. While I... Is that the... My gates. I don't want. Okay. As long as it's behind it and not in the gate, that's fine. Putting this one <laughs> station to work, man. I am putting them to work. that direction things without power oh I'm okay you are all out of lucid usage you are out are all out of power okay well go power output increased oh I cannot wait for you to be um, auto so now I need
of those. They don't fight. Select my angst. Uh, I don't like it when they have that unfit stamina recovery rate. Military if alpha. Dominance. No, we're not choosing the intolerant one. I don't like it. I don't like it. What do I need? Four? Beaker. I need four on the beaker. Okay. <sighs> you and you. Go to town. Oh, I'm still on the times threes one. Whoops. Uh, let's not do that. I don't need the game getting overly out of control on me. That needs water. I know that much already. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Not... To that degree, though. Okay. And then I also need... Probably just put this in here. Hyperloop. And I guess I could have just built another one of them over here and just connected it to the Hyperloop, because as long as it's on the Hyperloop, it doesn't matter where I plop this thing. Yeah, see, as long as they're in the Hyperloop, it doesn't matter. But it doesn't hurt to scatter them for the sake of the um, extender things. Oh, these are done. Um, release bear air, air, airlift. Asset requiring collection. Picking up asset. So that's incubate and release the following dinosaurs. Four Dometrodons. Already prepped one. Oh my god, this part takes forever. Alright. The helicopters take too long. Mission complete. Heart and lung muscle spring item unlocked. Cool. <sighs> okay. Asset transportation underway. In 
transit. Confirming asset delivery. Once they all get delivered, I'll, uh... Asset transportation complete. I'll pop this back onto normal. What? Asset has been delivered. How the heck did you... Must have been when they didn't have power. Okay. I just... can't deal with the slowness of this man drink that one next please heading to collect the asset collecting asset assets in the air Oh, it's because it's in the air. Asset transportation in progress. Asset delivered. Asset transported. No sources of common cold remain in the park. Yes! That's what I wanted to see. Okay, I need to get... Missing sand. You want sand. Water? I have water, my dude. Oops. Okay. We're building another response one because this is driving me nuts now. Path not connected, that's fine, I can fix it. Okay. Where did I put your thing? Actually, hold on, unassign that one. Reassign that one. Reassign that one. Reassign that one. Dimetrodon. Okay. Dimetrodon. That's not what I wanted. You're the one I wanted. Dimetrodon. Boom. They are still missing water. Dang, you guys require a ton of water.
Thanks in part to your efforts, it's becoming clear that Biosyn will be the home of paleobiology moving forward. Our future is found in the past. Ah, I like that. Sure, we've had some difficulties, that was expected, but you handled it well. I think we can now move forward with the next phase of Biosyn. We have a world-class operation. Let's take it global. Biosyn will represent the past, present, and future. So, what do we focus on next? We focus on upgrading our research compound. That'll give us benefits across the board. Ah, I want a crown jewel. Something we can all be proud of. Do the research. We're shooting for 100% complete dinosaur genomes. The genetic link between birds and dinosaurs has long been established. Now, with a feathered dinosaur, we can finally have our proof. Yeah, with a living specimen. It's gonna be incredible. Well, what are we waiting for? Time to get started on the research. That sounds fun. Oh my god, they still want more water. Dude, these things are... Thirsty boyos. Now you're content. Okay. Your biome is entirely weird, but, you know, whatever. Alright. Ready to research? Go to research. Number four out of five. Interesting. One, two, three, four. Oh, I see. Um, allows creation of dinosaurs, facilities, and personnel to collect, combine, and store dinosaur genomes. What do I need? I need ten beaker. I'll deal with it after I make my scientists rest. That's an emergency bunker. I need this one. You, my scientists, you rest you. Okay. You're about to be disgruntled. Let's just rest everybody for now. Everybody gets to rest. Alright, well, this has been going for about an hour, so I'm going to leave it here. Oh, if you guys enjoyed, hit like, subscribe, and click on the little bell that the next one comes out. Otherwise, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.